to show it right now. Ready to go. Hi. Hi. My name's Andrew. I'm here at the pharmacist here at Drake. Hi, Andrew. I'm here just to counsel you on your medication. Okay. Make sure you get the best use out of it while still being safe. So, right, may I have your permission to continue at the time? Sure, definitely. All right, well, I want to make sure I have the right person, of course. Your name, Joyce Smith. Yes, sir. All right, perfect. And it looks like your doctor prescribed you Invilcana, mm -hmm. 100 milligrams. Now, what did he tell you this was for? My diabetes. Yes, it uh, can also go by the name canagliflozin, and it's for type 2 diabetes. Okay. The way it works is it lowers your blood sugar and your A1C by excreting extra sugar or getting rid of extra sugar in your urine. Okay. All right, so that should help lower both your blood sugar and your A1C. Um, what did he tell you about how to take this medication? Um, once a day, and I take it with, I can take it with my other medication. Yes. I take others. <laughs> yes, you can take it just once a day, and if you find that you're tolerating it well and that um, it's not working quite as well as you want it to, there is room to go up. Okay. Uh, the most common side effect is urinary tract infections, so that's something to watch out for, something to let your doctor know if you notice any of those popping up, and um, a common way to pre or a good way to prevent that is just good hygiene in the bathroom. Um, it can also cause low blood sugar. It's not as quite as high risk as some other medications along with the metformin, but it's just real important to keep up with your blood sugar checks to make sure you don't drop below. Okay. So it looks like he gave you three refills. I looked over your profile and I did not see any drug interactions that were too concerning. The only thing was with the lisinopril and the hydrochlorothiazide with the canagliflozin. I might be a little worried if you have poor kidney. So I had, you had, has your doctor assessed your kidney function recently, or do you have any um, healthy kidney uh, function? As far as I know, I do. Yeah, mm -hmm. I haven't had any issues. Well, I assume he wouldn't have prescribed this medication if he, he had poor kidney function. Okay. So but that's just something to watch out for if you should notice your kidney function. Just the combination of all these medications, it can be difficult on okay. kidneys. All right, and he gave you three refills here, it looks like, so you should be set for the next three or four months. So I just say that the most important things are the fact that it will help lower your blood sugar and A1C and to watch out for the urinary tract infections. And if you have any questions, let me or your doctor know. Um, since I'm taking two for the <coughs> same thing, they work differently? Yes, they work differently. And they work well in concert with okay. one another. The metformin kind of works by it helping your liver reduce your blood sugar output by making sure it doesn't make too much blood sugar and it also helps increase uh, the sensitivity of the rest of the cells in your body to insulin. Okay. I think that's, that's it. it. Thank you.